Scribramachi here. Many humans see horses as majestic animals with their natural strength and athleticism. They are undoubtedly stunning animals, but few recognize how diverse their appearances may be. I love horses, even though mom won't let me get one. <laughs> but these horses are very pretty and they are called curly horses. They've been featured in Chinese artwork back as far as 161 AD and spotted in South America within the 19th century. Sioux Indians held curlies in high regard and they are reserved as transportation horses for chiefs and medicine men. Whether they're working hard, interacting with one another, or goofing around, these curlies are something to behold. Regardless of their foundation, one factor is their capability to pleasure and captivate their audiences. They are known for their calm, intelligent, and friendly personality, easily trainable temperament, and are also known for having a tough constitution and great stamina. They enjoy being around people, are typically not flighty, and tend to be more reasoning than most breeds. They are very reliable and have a great work ethic. Their unique, the unique gene that gives curlies their curly hair, which is most obvious with their winter coat, can be expressed minimally. Horses that exhibit curly hair inside their ears at fetlocks and a kinky mane and tail. Or maximally, horses that exhibit curls all over their body, has dreadlocked mane, and has curly eyelashes and guard hairs. And extreme, very tight extreme curls, but when they shed out for summer, can shed entirely bald, or any variation in between. The coat in the summer shows a slight wave in it, but not as extreme as the winter curls. Some purebred curlies exhibit no curl at all, called smooth coat curlies. They have split manes and are not braided or clipped when shown, and are most commonly chestnut colored, but can be found in any, every color. The care for their curly hair is simple, with most people choosing to not comb the mane because the hair will lose its curliness. The manes are often trimmed to keep them from matting. The tails can be combed. They are claimed to be the only hypoallergenic horse breed. Most people allergic to horses can handle these horses without suffering any allergic reaction. Research indicates a protein is missing from the hair of curlies, which may be what causes allergic reactions to horses and allergy sufferers, but the study was never officially published. Members of the curly community are working towards funding more research on this topic. The origins of the curly horse are highly debated, and research is mostly still in progress. Disagreements of the curly horse's history result in confusion of what the breed really is and what it should be called. One theory is that the origin of the breed is Iberian. It has been noted that foals of cross-bred horses have curly hair. This suggests that the curly gene is dominant. There are multiple theories for how the American curly developed, but all I know is they are absolutely beautiful. I don't know if you've ever seen a curly before. I never had, but I'm just educating myself. And you too. <laughs> Cooper Matcha here. Ciao.